You know what, my Dudorinos? I had a thought just now. Um, my thought is that I have to go to the tower. If it launches me into a cutscene, I'm going to be a little pissed. a quick trip because I want to understand more about Back this weapon crafting crafting. stuff. Ascendant alloys. Curious. Master Rule looks up from his research. These are rare materials that only manifest in specific areas of conflict. While Banshee and I can provide this material to guardians, our supplies are quite limited. If you need larger quantities of these alloys, you will need to seek out these conflict zones. Ascendant alloys can be purchased in limited quantity quantities from Banshee 44 and Master Rule. These alloys can also be acquired from weekly campaign missions in the throne world and from the wellspring activity in the throne world. Master Ravul, dedicated to power crypt arc, holds out a shadowy engram. Hissing strands of darkness lick off its sur surfaces as you peer into its swirling depths. Welcome, Guardian. This is an umbral engram. He says, capable of granting unmatched rewards if one knows how to focus its contents. He tells you the war table is capable of focusing on rule engrams through a series of lenses and suggests you try focusing one yourself. A skilled crypt dark, and I humbly consider myself in that category, is certainly capable of simply opening an umbrella engram for you. However, their mysterious contents remain in flux, and I would be remiss if I did not suggest that trying to focus one before you hand it over to me. He graciously hands you the umbral engram, focus umbral engrams to choose their contents at the war table in the helm. All right. Oh, and then that's right. He's doing a material exchange now. Which Queen Sparrow? I think I can dismantle my Christmas Sparrow. The best cryptarchs dig and dig, and one day the garden blooms. A lot can happen in 72 hours. Three days can change the course of a hundred lives. Oh, my back's killing me. Okay, return to the relic. Speak to me not of the darkness. I want no part. There's gotta be a better way. Call the boss. Okay, hang on. We're gonna we're going back to uh We're going back to the Enclave real quick. What does the TD part mean? Or, oh, originally shaped. Psychohack. Sustained damage on this weapon lowers the target damage output for a short... Okay. Oh, I already, that's right, I already. Okay. A shaped weapon can be continually enhanced by reshaping it with new components and perks. The higher the level, the higher the quality of components available. Take the Enigma to the Relic on Mars and reshape it. Select reshape, okay. And unequipped, okay. Hang on, let me just equip this random sidearm here. Okay. 
Oh. Insert an enhanced intri intrinsic to. Hang on, let me just. Enhanced intrinsic, okay. Do any of these matter? Shield duration, handling, range, reload speed. I want the shield duration. Reshape the Enigma with an enhanced trait. Enhanced traits are more effective than base traits. Each trait is aligned with a specific resonant element and requires ascendant alloys to upgrade. Blocking damage with your shield increases movement speed until you lower your shield for an improved. Ooh, wait. I might want threat detector, actually. Greatly enhance increased reload. Nope, actually, we want. That's the one we want. Warning perk cost will not be refunded if replaced. Weapon shaped, okay. Turn to the relic in the Enclave on Mars. Use shaped weapons in combat and activities in order to level them up and, re and unlock better components. There is no time limit to the number of times a weapon can be reshaped. Experimentation with different components is highly encouraged. Gather resonant materials like resonant elements, ascendant alloys, and weapon patterns to create and customize your favorite weapons. Alright, quest completed. Awesome. Can I make a... Uh... Ooh, I could make that if I wanted to. Or that. Oh, the exotic comes from. Okay. Likely suspect, oh no. Tarnation. What in Tarny? <laughs> I love it. Red herring. I wonder, okay. So where is the next? Okay, it's actually on. Okay, so here's my problem so far. I, <clears throat> I'm a little annoyed because I want, <laughs> like, what I need is a way to be able to create more, more orbs. Like, the whole... It, it's much harder to do things now because of the, what they... It's actually much harder to survive because of this nerf to orb generation. Not gonna lie. Okay, legendary... 
We power capped at 1405 like before? Okay. I think this is mission number five and it said there were eight missions, so. Yeah. Guardian, the psychic energy my hidden detected is concentrated in this area. Find the source, and you might be able to learn more from Sagira's shell. It's possible she learned how Savathun stole the Traveler's light before she died. There must be some clue here. Search the area. I've delivered the general location data to your ghost, though I don't have anything precise. Okay, so the ghost shows to serve the hive, it looks like, but... At the same time, there's more to it. <gasps> I can finally summon my sparrow. I'm sensing pyramid related interference between us and the coordinates Ikora sent. There must be a way to get around it. Tarnish, Chieftain. Okay, great. Shit, the Tarnished Chieftain got me. You know what? That, right there. Off. That's contributing to the interference. Maybe we can destroy it. What was that? That helped, but I'm picking up another source of interference. Let's track it down. It reminded me of the Black Heart a little bit, but there's something else to it. I don't know how to describe it. I don't know why. Press L2 to get down. Which is Echo? Okay. Ikora, we encountered pyramid interference. The one on Europa was so welcoming to us. What changed? On Europa, I suspect that your purposes overlap neatly with the pyramids. You destroyed the Cabal. It granted you more power. Here, your presence hardly registers. You have nothing to ask for and nothing to offer. Remember, the pyramid entity considers itself neither our friend nor our enemy. Got it. Statues and whatnot.
What? Oh. Okay, you need deep sight to actually pass through that wall. It's a fake object. Yo, oh, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you, that's why. Asshole. Okay. There's a couple different ways I could go, but we're gonna see what just see what happens when I press the reveal button. Okay. Oh, another okay. These old half-forgotten pathways. That power you're using is making them real again. Rebuilding them through memory. Strange. Hopefully Sagira's shell holds that same potential. With the right concentration of psychic energy, a resonant memory connected to her shell will manifest. But this is all theoretical still. It's never been done. Ikora, we still haven't found anything. But I have an odd feeling. Sort of like deja vu. That's consistent with what my hidden described. Follow that feeling. Take your time. Pick your path carefully. This is our only lead. Oh, okay. And then you're gonna try to shoot my ghost while you're feeling glee, right? But guess what? I got res down here, bitch. Fuck you. Now I'm confused. Are they just telling me to go back this way, or what? Once we learned Sabathun was impersonating Osiris, I wanted to believe Sagira was still alive, trapped somewhere, like him, and that if we played our cards right, we'd free her too. But at least we found her. She can help us one last time, and then we can bring her home. Okay, we can go whichever way we prefer. Oh! Shit, okay. Come on, just resume ghost. That was embarrassing, okay? <laughs>
until it leads back over this way. I mean, no? Am I, did I do... Did I mess up? Hang on. Okay. Okay, so there's another spike somewhere. That's where we came from. All right, hang on. I have to try to fix something because I'm noticing the deep sight thing is not there. Where it should be. Okay, hang on. So what am I missing here? Hang on. Hang on, I'm being, I think I'm being an idiot again. Hang on, hang on. Footsteps say, I mean, no, I gotta go down this way. Okay, I just, I missed this door somehow. Okay, I can go through here and then I can go through the other door here once I get this steep side activated. Yeah, and then I can go through here. Aha! Oh, mm, thank you, Bungie, for not giving me any super immunity. I love it. All the other classes get this great super immunity. Dodge and was out of the way. Oh, the said scorn crossbow killed me. Well, either way, I dodged and turned invisible, so that shouldn't have been an issue. Now we gotta go get our deep sight. Alright, I 
assumption is going to be it's in various parts of the room. the next one. Oh, right here. Alright, let's go. Cora, I think we found it. There's something here. Find a connection point. We need answers now. Every chest has like every mission has like what three sets of chests, so probably this, so this should be our first set. Okay. Oh, god damn it. I went right. Why'd I go right in with my super? I don't usually do that. And now the scorn are arriving, and the pyramid has sealed us off. Come on, come on. Snipers. Okay, hang on. Hang on. I'm gonna adjust my mods for this real quick. Probably what I should have done in the first place. I 
honestly have that much health as a boss. Let's just work on whittling him down. Fell right on him. Granted light. Okay, let's go back to the granted light thing. Why are we being granted light? Okay, 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 okay.
Okay. <sighs> I'm sorry that I go silent a lot. I get, like, really highly focused on these boss fights because I don't want to die during them. All right, let's grab the gear that's here. Not as fragile and we'll... Oh. Strange that I get to keep that one, but okay. Okay, let's see. What do I wanna I'll I'll increase glimmer gains. <clears throat> Distorted symbols. I can't quite make them out. Oh, I I get it. Is this place Ikora we've been transported somewhere it doesn't look like the rest of Sabathun's throne world Ikora oh no we lost her guardian I guess we're going in alone altar of reflection it looks kind of, yeah stand before a being with a thousand names. It whispers one. The witness. Remember it. Remember that name. It is not darkness, but something that wears it like a cloak. It gives darkness a wicked shape. I refuse to be its servant. I spent centuries crafting schemes, playing tricks, finding loopholes. And then I select my new name. A man with many enemies and few friends. But those friends know secrets. About the light. About new beginnings. My plan takes shape. That came from Sagira's shell. Like a psychic imprint. A memory. Sabathun's memory. And if that's what it was, it means she used Ikora's relationship with Osiris to learn something about the light. Something dangerous. What, what could it be? <laughs> This was, okay, that was a short mission, I guess. I guess some of the missions are shorter. Which is nice, honestly. Not the worst thing in the world. Also, I like the change from the campaign being... Hey, hey, are you there? We're here, Finch. Oh, good, 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 good. I've been trying to reach you. I couldn't get through. Look, I got another tip for you. Big lead on your next clue. So, uh, come meet me. No time to lose. Hang on, let me remember how to... Okay, I'm going to just transport myself directly to him. Yeah. Alright, let's go talk to him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Whoa, 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 you saw a what? A memory? See, see, I knew Sagira's shell would start us in the right direction. I knew it! Okay, here's the tip. Ever heard of Oryx? The Taken King? Savathun's brother? Yeah, yeah, we killed him. Okay, I thought so. Savathun's got a temple dedicated to him. I, I, look, I know what you're thinking. Who cares, right? But we found Sagira's shell in a temple dedicated to the sister, Zivu. Imagine what we could find in Oryx's temple. Okay, as far as how we get in? Well, you just leave that to me. Oh, complete the light blade strike. Okay. Uh, I'll probably just go and do that part with... I'll get, like, Stella and uh, Matt and see if they want to do that one with me. Light Blade, 1430. Okay, so we're going to want to go above 1430 for that. Um, also... Let's give the big guy some space, yeah? He's, he's been through a lot, what with the dying. So, let him, you know, just let him get some rest. Also, uh, let's see. You know what? We'll go with Glaive Dexterity for now. All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna end the episode here. Like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. This was definitely an easier mission than the other. Maybe it's just me getting used to it, but I don't know. I'll see you guys in the next one. Later, is my Deuterinos.